Okay. Well, right now, country music lovers are partying into the night for the second year of Country Superfest. You are looking live inside Everbank Field, where the Zac Brown Band is performing. Earlier this afternoon, we caught up with some of the excited fans at FanFest. I'm a little jealous. It's pre-show <laughs> where they got to meet and greet with their favorite artists and could hear a few tunes from uh, the coming up show. Channel 4's Francesca Amaker has been at Everbank talking with fans all day. She's joining us live. Fran, <laughs> I said it, I'm jealous. It looks like you're having fun out there. <laughs> Don't be jealous, but at the same time, be very jealous. I got my, my cowboy hat on or my, and my cowgirl boots on. I am really feeling the spirit out here. Now, I will say this, right now on stage, I don't know if you can hear it. Go ahead and try to hear it. Right now, the Zach Brown Band is on the stage, and I mean, they sound amazing right now. But people are actually starting to leave the stadium, which is kind of weird to me because the Zach Brown Band continues up until like 1130. But people are leaving after Keith Urban. Guess they've had enough for one day, but this will continue tomorrow. And some of the folks that I ran into actually think they're the country music stars themselves. Because where I come from is cornbread and chicken. From the top of his head to his mini cowboy shorts, you might be able to hear that country music runs deep through this Nashville native's veins. Who are you most excited to see this weekend? Cole Ford. Cole Why? Ford. Because it's my roots. I grew up on a cattle farm. Um, I'm all about country. Uh, so, I mean, I just, I just love the music. It, it, it brightens my soul, you know what I mean? And thousands of people attending Country Superfest knew exactly what he meant, especially when they heard sounds from country star Cole Swindle. Chilling in the back of a four-wheel drive, I'm about to call the Then there was country music star Keith Urban, who brought down the house. More than just music, Saturday night was about forming everlasting memories, even if those memories were of a good old country dinner. On a Friday night, cold beer, drink it all, chicken fried, yep. What was he talking about? I had no idea, but I had to let you just kind of hear some of the, the, the things that fans had to say out here. They said that this is country's in their blood and, and this event was what they've been waiting for all year long. And this is just a great time to be with their friends and family. Now coming up at 11, this will continue tomorrow. So I got some tips that you need to listen to so that you can make it a full day from hydration, sunscreen. EMS was out here, about 30 of them were out here earlier today. And fortunately they only had to deal with three or four people. Whoop. Hi there. So then there's lots of fans who are just really enjoying the show. Did you enjoy the show? I loved it. <laughs> Well, thank you so much. And, and like I said, we're making a lot of friends here tonight, and folks are just kind of walking in my live shot. But I'm going to wrap up here. Tomorrow, these folks are coming back again for day two. Won't you be back? I will be back tomorrow. Certainly. And yeehaw to that. Howdy. We'll see you tomorrow, all right? For now, I'm live at Everbank Field. Francesca Amerker, Channel 4, the local station. <laughs> I'm sorry. That That's was what perfect. happens. You know, and you know why they're all leaving now is because.